beautiful love. In the spring of 2020, Bertie at Goethe's, in the Mayflower Steps near the Barbican, had a mural made, preparing for the big festival of 2020, Mayflower 400. But unfortunately, Mayflower 400 didn't happen in 2020, so hopefully it'll happen in 2021. Ahoy there, me hearties. We're about to set sail on this here ship. Now, Ooh, here we come with us. Now, but this time I'm going to Goethe's and I'm going to see an artist there. I'll um, find out what she's uh, doing. Hello. Hello. What's your name? Um, Kate Crawford. Hello. Um, nice to meet from? you. Sorry. Uh, nice to meet you too, Kate. Kate. So where are you from? Um, I'm from Kent originally and I've been in Plymouth for 20 years. I love it here. Uh-huh. And what are you doing here? Um, I'm painting a mural for for the Mayflower 400. Yes. Um, and it's it's based on a, a really beautiful story about Priscilla, the Mayflower of Plymouth. Yeah. Who um, who sailed to America on the Mayflower, uh-huh. lost her parents and brother in the first hard winter there, and was probably the only young eligible female. A beautiful girl of 19 and then there's um, the captain fell in love with her and another man fell in love with her as well so the captain sends his friend to woo her for him but she rejects the captain and falls in love with the other man yeah Um, and so this couple Priscilla Mullins and John Alden um, they have ten children together and many millions of Americans can um, can follow their ancestry back to the couple. So they went to Massachusetts. I think it's between six. Uh, I could get, well, it's well over six million to start with, but it could be up to about twenty-five million descendants now. Yeah, from uh, Mayflower. All coming through from Massachusetts, from Plymouth, UK. Yeah, indeed. Which is yeah. quite amazing. It? Just shows how the network of, you know, the, the species works. Yeah. So how did you hear about the story? Um, I was just interested in Mayflower history, so I looked it up. Yeah. There's a very long poem about it. So how did you get in? Uh, what's the poem then? Uh, the Courtship of Miles Standish. Yes. Uh, which goes on quite uh, eloquently for a very long time. <clears throat> to and fro in his best, in his breast, his thoughts were heaving and dashing as a foundry. <laughs> With ev- We're in a kitchen, so we have to understand that. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> to and fro in his breast, his thoughts were heaving and dashing as a foundering ship. As every roll of the vessel washes the bitter sea, the merciless surge of the ocean. So my mural is going to take her face um, in the pilgrim yes. bonnet, and then her hair, which is flying free in the wind. And just like this, yeah. Yep. Um, will become the ocean with the Mayflower tossing and foundering upon it. So this is your um, this is your worksheet, is it? The yeah, one? this is my worksheet. This is my wall. This is my worksheet. So when do you hope to have it done by? Mm, maybe tomorrow. Yes. A few days. So how did you get into art originally? Um, I always painted walls. Yes. Since I was well. I was allowed to when I was 10, I probably painted them before that, but oh. I started painting, um, I painted my school walls and then I painted, painted my home walls and then I started painting theatre walls yes. and I like painting walls. <laughs> so you've got a lot of commissions for theatres then? Yeah, I work really a lot is. for theatre and also for um, just businesses and people's homes. What theatres have you worked with? I've worked at Sydney Opera House, I've worked at cool. quite a lot of big London theatres. Did you go over to Sydney? Yep. Nice one. Yep. Um, and I work a lot for the Theatre Royal in Plymouth now. Yes. So you do the morals for the backdrops and things like that? Yep. Yep. Tremendous. Yep. It's a great job. I love so it. So how can people contact you? Um, through my website. Yes. And what's that? Um, it's www.katecrawford co.uk but Crawford is spelt with a U so it's C R A W F U R D. It's a bit unusual. 
Thanks a lot for your time, anyway. That's all right. And good luck, I'm looking forward to seeing the finished product. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> so, what is it you've got there? Um, Caesar. 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 Is it Julius Caesar? It's Julius Caesar. Uh, Julius it certainly Caesar. is. And you eat uh, Gertie's, uh, Gertie's regularly, do you? Most days, yes. Nice one. Most weekends. How much did that cost then? Uh, it's about what? About three pound fifty. Three pound fifty. Three pound fifty. Three pound fifty. It's a bargain. Nice one. And um, what's the latest on the uh, Priscilla mural? Hmm? What's the latest on the Priscilla mural at the moment? On that side. Oh, Priscilla, Queen of the Desert. Oh, she's coming up. Hopefully in a couple of weeks I'll speak to the artist and hopefully we'll get it finished for next year, but there's no rush with Mayflower not on. Yeah. So we'll see how it goes. So how did you manage during the... Uh, yeah, it's been a while. It's been uh, ticking along. Lost a lot in April, but we've sort of scooped back a little bit. So an average year, really, it's which is not too bad. It's been really good. Yeah. Uh, self isolating, of course. Yeah, no, it's, it was nice. I had time off with the kids. Yeah, nice one. Which is rare for me. Okay, cool. See you soon. Oh, there, me hearties. We're about to set sail on this here ship. Now, will you be coming with us? Or are you too scared? Big ship sinks. Ali ali o, ali ali o, ali ali o. Big ship sinks. Ali ali o. On the last day of September. Of the sea. 